Yo guys, what's going on? It's me, KLV, and today I'm going to show you on how you can get a free legendary in the new game Outriders. Now, this takes about 10 minutes to do, and you only can do this once, so if you haven't done it, I recommend doing it. So, for starters, what you want to do is you want to go to the uh, Canyon of the Grand Obelisk. Now, if you haven't got to here, I highly recommend getting to here, and uh, you can do this. It takes like 10 minutes to do. It's very, really, really simple to do if you have basically completed the majority of the story, and it just gives you a free legendary. It's completely random on what you get. Uh, some people's got helmets, some people's got a body, some people I've got a shotgun. Uh, it's completely random on what you get. Uh, so put in the comment section down below on what you have gotten from doing this. Now, I believe you only can do this once. Uh, I did this earlier and the chest didn't actually give me a legendary because I've already done it before. Uh, I don't know if it's like a 24 hour cooldown because I did it like at night, sometime at night time. But basically, yeah, yeah, you basically do a couple of uh, side quest type things, you could say and uh yeah it gives you it's like really simple so it's literally like 10 minutes to do so that's what you're gonna do is you want to run out to here out of the camp and when you get to here instead of going forward what you want to do is take a left right here down this path what is going to be is going to be this key right here what you can then activate you want to then activate this key so we'll activate the key and then what you want to do is you want to take the normal path that you normally take once you took the normal path, you come across some enemies, what we'll talk about when we get to it. Because what you want to do is you want to make us way up to there, right there. So again, you want to just run back, take the normal path like you normally do. And then there'll be a couple of enemies. Now these enemies take a while to kill. You have to kill all of them to actually activate the next uh, key, uh, the next thing. So you have to kill all of these enemies. So what I recommend doing is just killing them as quick as possible as you can. And... Uh, yeah, so these can give a couple of epics as well. I've gotten two epics, like eight each time I've done it because I recorded this multiple times and the server has disconnected me every single time I try to do it. And uh, it gave me two epics, majority of the time. Sometimes it gave me one, but I didn't kill all the uh, enemies. But majority of the time you're gonna get two epics. So if you wanna farm some epics, this is a nice little area to do so. All right, so I believe these two are the last enemies. There's that one dead and that one dead. All right, so there we go. So now what you wanna do, is you want to instead of going this way you want to take a right and go up these stairs uh, i'm just gonna go claim with this epic i'm probably gonna get some of rubbish but uh might as well claim it and then what you want to do is basically yeah just make your way up these stairs right here take a left into this building and there is another key there is also a chest there so if you want to open a chest you can open that chest as well now i'm i'm gonna open the chest because i don't know you might get something decent out of it you might get an epic whatever but uh yeah, there's also some stuff you can harvest there as well. So it's a nice little, nice little area you can go to. Uh, we didn't get too much good. But yeah, so now what you want to do is you want to take the normal path again. And you want to make your way over this way. But yeah, so basically what you want to do is you want to now run up to here. And then just kill all the enemies in this general vicinity. Uh, I'm going to skip until we have killed them all. So yeah, we've completed that bit now. So now what you have to do is you have to go to this where it says open door. Open this door. Very, really, really simple. Then what you want to do is you want to follow this door down this way. So you want to go now down here. Just follow the path as normal. And you see this door here with the glowing, uh, the glowing stuff on it. You, we will be going in there to get our legendary to go in there. But we need to get one more uh, like pillar. What is it? over here to get what's down here that we need to go do so what you're gonna do is make our way down to here uh, again i recommend restocking also putting your flag there as well for teleportation so what you want to do is you want to just restock very simple and you make your way down this way and over to this way so what you want to do now again is just clear out all the enemies these aren't as uh, hard to be honest these ones are quite easy as well and then it said now you have to open up this gate and the last key is going to be right at the back of this area so you open this key by doing this again and what you want to do is you want to run all the way to the end right over there where my dot is where the sensor is and you can see it right there where you have to uh, basically go all right so that's the last key that you have to activate so now you want to make your way back to where the uh, where that door is with the symbols on so if you see here new quest forgotten chapel yeah so now we have nearly got there now and it's gonna be really simple again you just need to activate another key 
and then this key will then basically just open up the door and there you go you are sorted so making your way back to the door and here is what you have to press so you just press this to open this again and your legendary chest should be in here now you probably saw by the start of the clip as well that it does give you a legendary so it's not like it doesn't give you a legendary because it does uh, so yeah, you basically just open this chest and it will give you a legendary if it's your first time I got a purple then what's quite nice, but uh, yeah, it gives you a legendary if it's your first time uh, I don't know if you can get a legendary multiple times But um, I've done it. This is my third time doing it first time I got a legendary second time I got a blue this time I got a purple so you might be able to get a legendary at it, but I'm not even sure so uh, yeah if you guys did enjoy this video, make sure you drop a like and subscribe to the channel. It'd be very much appreciated. It helps me out a ton. Also, tell me in the comments on what comment section down below on what you got out of the chest. If you've got like a, a, a helmet, a gun, or whatever. Tell me what you got. And uh yeah. See you guys later. Peace out.